like yeah. that. Right? All of it. All of it. That, you know, and a bowl of popcorn, I'm good, you know. Um, so, I, what I wanted to do is I didn't want to just have the world of the vampires and disallow all the other monsters. I'm like, well, what about the poltergeist and what about the phantoms and what about the succubi and the incubi and la la la. You know, all the different phyla of, of things that could be spewed up from hell in all the movies that I have seen. And I thought, well, you got to have some organization. You know, like, who's running what? Because if you go to see Underworld, you know, the the uh, werewolves have their own thing going on. And if you go to see, you know, any vampire flick, you would think that they were the only ones out there. Um, so that was really where I came. I said, okay, let me organize it using Dante's, you know, in front of those levels. And then let me just see. Um, who are the badasses? Well, that would be, you know, your werewolves are like, you know, brute strength, you know. And, um, but then the vampires are, are like, they have all this, this, um, this intellect. And yet they also have the power of, and they, and th that was where I thought they should be the closest to Satan because they can do everything. They can be phantom mist. They can turn into the wolf. They can, you know, basically uh, come in, in a miasma, you know, they can take your mind in a vapor, you know, all these things that they could do, like the possession demons, they can do all that stuff. So I, I said they would have to be the ruling class of, of monsters. Cause, and I had this conversation with my sister, and, and we're like laughing on the phone. It was it was a kind of a conversation that you have. If there was the mummy, Frankenstein, you know, Wolfman versus Dracula, who would win? You know? <laughs> It was, it was quite, it was about that, um, that scientific, as, you know, just an opinion fest between me and my sister, but, you know, yes? Yes,